Hi, morning everyone. Um, this is possibly um, the the strangest place I've, I've maybe made a video um, and probably uh, one of the latest I've actually made, uh, made a video as well. Um, look, excuse the way I am, it's, I'm just going to look at the clock, it's it's quarter past one in the morning. Look, I just uh, if you can if you can see that there, I don't know if that's if that's picking it up or not. Um, but yeah, it's it's quarter past one in the morning. Um, I'm in bed. Uh, you can obviously there you can sort of see see my surroundings and uh, see see my bedroom. Um, I'm laying in bed, you can see I've got, got, got a t-shirt on, I'm absolutely freezing anyway, blah blah blah, etc, etc. Uh, so yeah, that's my excuse for this uh, this dreadful look of, of how I'm looking right now. But look, the reason for this video, as I said, it's quarter past one in the morning. And I've just had uh, an email come through uh, from a guy called Dan Bradbury. Now, some of you may or may not have heard of the guy. Um, and to be fair, I only know of the guy through uh, Nick James from uh, Market Domination, who does the, the copywriting, etc. But I've been following Dan for, for some time on Facebook. And what's, what's been quite strange, like, this, this year has been, uh, well, not necessarily this year, like, the, the last sort of six months of this year, or well, the last few months of this year, sorry, have been been a bit strange for myself in regards of. Um, I've kind of I, I took my foot off the accelerator. Um, what do I mean by that? Well, you know, years and years I've spent, you know, working, training, and, and helping others. I've spent years in recruitment, interviewing, and you know, helping others get jobs and. You know, I've spent years where I've been really comfortable and confident about what I've done, always been very good and very successful with what I've done. But over the last few years of having so many things that, uh, personal things that have happened to me and, and my family, you know, um, various different deaths, well, seven, seven family funerals in, in 2009 and you know, splitting up from relationships and losing a house and having to close one business and setting up what I'm doing now, etc., etc. So over the last few years, you know, I've really let things sort of get to me personally and I'm really not my confidence. And my confidence has been up and down, up and down, up and down. And, you know, the start of this year, again, was absolutely awesome for me. Absolutely incredible, fantastic start. And then for whatever reason, the last few months, again, like I say, I've let something get to me. And what that's been is I've, I've allowed myself to, to beat myself up, right? Because for whatever reason, I've got, I've allowed, um, I don't know the best way to describe this. Sorry, guys. It's, as I said, it is quarter past one in the morning, but... What I've done is, I've been concerned about what other people have thought about me, okay? What do I mean by that? Well, instead of making videos like this, okay, and, and putting myself out there to the public and, you know, really letting people know what I'm good at and how I help people, you know, I help people set up businesses and I'm not just talking about telling them about in, uh, internet marketing, affiliate marketing, and, and, and all the other BS that's out there, okay? Yes, I do that, and I enjoy doing that. But, you know, as a coach, I actually set people up with a genuine business, okay? Between myself and my five staff, the outsourcers that I've got working for me, we build the website, we do the coaching, we generally, we actually set people up in business, okay? In a proper business okay as I said I'm not just talking about the normal sort of internet marketing malarkey yeah over three years ago uh, I bought into a franchise which I found out the other day when I bought into this it was ten thousand pound and I, I went online the other day because I'm just putting a very high ticket uh, my highest ever ticket product uh, together 
So I was looking at the franchise that I bought into, and it's now up to twenty grand. Okay, they're charging twenty thousand pound to be a part of their franchise, which to me absolutely amazes me. But I also think, you know what? Fair play to them, because I know for what they're offering is absolutely nothing like what I'm offering. Okay, but why are they in a position to do that? Simply because they're not allowing other people to affect them yeah and that's what I've done I've really I, the last few months I've pulled myself away I've allowed myself to worry about what other people think about me and, and what I'm doing okay which is not like me at all and I don't know why I've done it but I have done and there's no excuses so as I said this video I mentioned Dan Bradbury at the beginning of this because I just want to say, Dan, if you, if you watch this video, over the last week or 10 days, I've gone to your site, I've been watching your little videos that you've been making, and I have to say, mate, I take my hat off to you. And I'm going to be honest here, some of the, some of the webinars and things that I've been on of yours, I've actually, I've actually thought you was a bit, of a, a bit of a dick, mate, I'll be honest with you. Uh, call me what you want, say what you want, but I have done, alright? Up until the last 10 days or so where I've actually realised the reason why you're so good at what you do is because you are bloody good at what you do, alright? I've gone on your site, it's inspired me to really pull my thumb out of my backside, look at myself, take a long hard think of myself to realise, Paul, you know what? You are bloody good at what you do. I know I'm good at what I do. And for whatever reason, I've stopped myself from, from saying that. Okay? I've stopped believing in myself. And thanks to what I've listened to what you've said, Dan, looked at your site, watched some of your videos, in the last 10 days, you have given me some real inspiration and the motivation to get back out there to say, you know what, Paul? You are a bloody good coach. You are good at what you're doing, okay? You can help people. You will inspire people, yeah? I know I will. I know I can, all right? And Dan, you've given me the belief again in the last 10 days to believe in myself. So thank you. Thank you ever so much for that. I really, really appreciate it. My thoughts and my opinion of what I've had from you, again, comment on this, you know, say what you want, mate, you know, but I just want to say, what I did think about you, mate, I completely take back, and I've never made a video like this before, and I've never said anything like this before, but honestly, Dan, thank you for the last 10 days, truly, truly inspirational, you are a true inspiration of what you do, thank you, thank you ever so much, I'm going to keep following you. Um, obviously, as I said, you may or may not know, I'm off out to India next year uh, in January for 10 weeks. But when I'm back, I'm going to make a point of coming to one of your workshops, your seminars, whatever you want to do. Because I want to meet you in person, I want to shake your hand, I want to thank you. And I know down well over the next few months, years or whatever, I'm going to follow you in so much detail. Because I know you are the person to take my coaching business to the next level. So Dan, thank you, thank you so much. Again, I do uh, apologise to everyone for the way I am. As I said, it's now, like I say, it's just gone 20 past one in the morning. Um, but like I say, this, is, this video is thanks to you, Dan. I'm sat here laying in bed, I'm buzzing, I'm excited, really looking forward to where my business is going, where my coaching business is going. Um, and I'm wide awake at, like I say, nearly half one in the morning. And that's thanks to you, Dan. The last 10 days or so, you've really, really inspired me. Thanks ever so much. Um, as I said, come the new year, I look forward to meeting you in person. And, you know, as I said, my thoughts have completely, my opinion have completely changed about you, mate. So thank you. Thanks ever so much. Cheers, Dan. Uh, thanks a lot. Take care for ever. Yeah, take care and thanks for everything you've done and, and the inspiration you've given me over the last ten days. Cheers, mate. Thank you. Bye, bye, bye.